This is a nurdle. It's a small, round, plastic bead. It's the starting point for all the plastic products that we use every day. Plastic starts out this way because it is by far the best way for companies to be able to reform plastic into its multitude of uses. Well, it's actually um, polymers that we produce here on site, so very essential products uh, that go into uh, the automotive industry. Lots of household and medical applications we uh, finally end up having our product uh, used for. We produce plastic in this format because it makes it very easy to transport. It also makes it most efficient for handling at the customers to put it into their processing equipment so it will melt quickly and be able to be transformed into the articles that we use in our homes. Plastics is an essential product for all of us. Uh, it ends up in uh, a lot of initiatives and applications that help to reduce CO2. So it's, it's vital for society. Plastic pollution is a serious issue. Nurdles are seen as part of the problem. Spills at an industrial level mean that nurdles can find their way into storm drains and then get washed out to sea. Once in the ocean, they are almost impossible to identify. Losing product into the environment is something that INEOS is absolutely committed to preventing. That's why they have signed up to international initiative Operation Clean Sweep. Here on this site, we take product spillage as seriously as we do safety and quality. It's a fundamental part of our activities here. I'm a local girl here, a Grangemouth girl, and so product spillage and any kind of waste actually is very important to me as a mum, as a, an employer, and part of the community at large. Across the Ineos site at Grangemouth, there are processes in place in order to ensure the plants are kept clean. For me, Operation Clean Sweep is all about ensuring zero pellet loss to the environment. Now that's not a new concept on site here in Grangemouth. We perform a very high standard of environment uh, management systems. We have a lot of procedures, behaviours in place to manage any pellet loss. However, what Operation Clean Sweep has done is provided us with a fantastic opportunity to benchmark what we're doing on site against other standards to make sure that we're sharing and learning best practices across industry and a very wide supply chain. And it's not just in Grangemouth that Operation Clean Sweep is in full force. It's across the entire group. Over in Norway, at the Ineos site in Rafnes, the same diligence is being exercised. The team there are just as dedicated to keeping plastic out of the environment. No, we basically kicked off a lot of the initiatives already a few years ago. And I think through the activity uh, of the OCS initiatives, I think this matter has become more and more uh, visible. The fact that we are training all of our employees on the matter is uh, extremely important because they now uh, know that it's uh, really a key priority for us and, and uh, the business to, to aim at zero pellet loss. We're really uh, doing something and uh, that a lot of the work has already been done uh, in the past and uh, will be done in the future.